Can you cut fabric with a CO2 laser? Yes, you can. And I'm going to go over some of the different settings I'm using. This is on a Monport 40 watt CO2 laser. And I'm going to be going over the settings for some different types of material. This is a viewer request. was wondering how well this would work to cut out shapes on a CO2 laser. So we're going to get at it here. I'll show you some examples. Here's what I'm cutting out because it has a little bit of fine detail on it. This is just a, a little bare. And of course I'm doing this a light burn. And it has some fine detail around the claws and around there's very tight places around the feet and in the mouth. So this is what I uh, like to use for testing things like this. So now we'll get into the different types of fabrics. Okay, the uh, fabrics I'm going to be going over here are this is Sunbrella. This is cotton jersey like uh, your t-shirts made out of. It's a cotton polyester blend. This here is denim. As you can see I've got good detail on everything. It, it did a really really good job at it. And then we have terry cloth or towel like your bathroom towels are made out of. These are 100% cotton here. Then uh, microfiber. We've got a couple of those. Little, like the little microfiber towels you buy for four for a buck and a quarter at uh, Dollar Tree. Then we have 100% polyester. This is a thin polyester, so the setting I'll be giving you will be more for this thin material. And then we have 100% cotton muslin. Oop, there we go. So I'll load one of these on here and I'll show you how well it works and then we'll get into the settings. I'm going to be running a piece of denim here because that's what I just got done doing and already have the settings and everything in there for it. One thing you want to make absolutely sure of is that your fabric is flat. If you need to iron it first, you can't be having any wrinkles or bubbles or anything in it or your results will be less than stellar. So close the lid here and I'll hit go. bear. If you can bear it. I'm going to do one more here on uh, the polyester. Uh, this is the answer to the question about it taking away any edges fraying and it does because it literally burns the fibers together. This is a, a pretty thin great uh, polyester here and the settings I'll be giving you. You may have to make some adjustments too for whatever thickness material you have. So as you can see, it came out just fine. I should, I'm going to clean my bed there because it's a little bit of that transferred to my little bear here. So what are my settings, you ask? Well, I write all this stuff down in my notable notes worth noting notebook. So on the cotton muslin, if you want to grab a pencil and write this down or whatever, I'm not, I don't have any chart made of this. It's just notes I make as I go. Uh, the cotton muslin, 30 millimeters per second. 40% power. Every value I'm going to be giving you here, I'm running at 40% power. Just keep it constant all the way through, just the speeds will change. Sunbrella, 20 millimeters per second, again 40% power. The 100% polyester, and again that was a thin polyester material, so you may have to slow your speed down a little bit. 30 millimeters per second, again 40% power. The microfiber towel, 25 millimeters per second. The uh, terry cloth, 
whether you're like your bath towel. It's 100% uh, cotton, uh, 8 millimeters per second, again 40% power. Then we have the cotton poly blend t shirt material that was at 20 millimeters per second. And the denim, last of all, there was 10 millimeters per second. And that was a worn denim. I didn't take a brand new pair of jeans and cut them up. Uh, it was a pair of jeans that had some holes in them and stuff, but I did use a part of the uh, old jeans that wasn't like all worn real thin, like the front of the legs or anything. It's uh, part of the lower back leg where it doesn't get a lot of wear. But there again, uh, your uh, fabric weight is going to make a difference on what your setting is going to be. But there's uh, just a little quick thing here. Use the Monport 40 watt CO2 laser show how to cut fabric on it. So if you got anything out of this, appreciate you getting a thumbs up, always helps the channel. I'm Roger in the laser room, in the loft, above the shop. Thanks for watching, see you on the next one.